Hello guys, what is up? Courtney here. Thanks for stopping by my channel today. Uh, today, let's just get right into it. I wanted to do kind of like a new type of video. Um, you're probably hearing a mower in the background. That is my neighbor just riding his little lawnmower around. <laughs> right into it. Behind me you're going to see my purse and some cleaning wipes and then you know the rest of the stuff like my drinks, my abundance of drinks. Um, so today I am going to take you with me along the trip of cleaning out my purse. It's a mess in there but we're gonna get in there, we're gonna see what's up. The stuff that I want to keep in there we are gonna clean it off with those little wipies and we're going to see what's up. And I also wanted to say I was really inspired to do this. I've been really into um, mindfulness and just getting your vibrations and your energy um, on right. And it's really, really been helping me out. Um, I started with my wallet and <clears throat> I learned it from like a podcast that I listened to how to always keep a little bit of money into your wallet. Um, and then clean out your wallet, have clean spaces, you know, your car, etc., etc., and that it puts good energy out into the universe um, because you're respecting the things that are yours. Um, so that's what I want to do with my purse because right now it just has a lot of stuff in there that I don't really need, and so I really want to go through there and I want to show my purse. Um, as an object that the universe has given me um, that I appreciate it and I appreciate how it holds you know the things that I need on a day-to-day -day basis um, and so it sounds maybe kind of weird at first but you want to respect the objects that the universe has given you um, and that you are blessed with on a day-to-day -day basis. <laughs> So here is my purse. Obviously, it's looking kind of sad. It's actually a really nice little side purse, um, but I haven't been taking good care of it. So we are going to get in here and we're gonna pretty much just dump everything out. I'm gonna show you what I'm dumping out. There's pockets on the outside and on this side as well. And then we are going to go through what we need and what we don't need. Okay. I can't even get the things out. <laughs> Jeez, you guys. Come on. <laughs> oh my goodness. Just, it's a mess in here. It's not good. Look at this. This is what I was talking about, you guys. You gotta respect your stuff. <laughs> See, like, I don't even know. I think this is a magnet. Like, what is this? <laughs> All right. You're probably like, girl, why did you decide to do this on your couch? <laughs> I have no idea. I have no idea what goes through my mind sometimes. <laughs> All right, anyways, let's get back to it. So, now we are dumping out the side pocket. with like way too many chapsticks and stuff in it. This is sad, you guys. This is pretty sad. Change. Second side pocket. I got a lot of weapons. <laughs> Don't mess with me. A lot of weapons, for sure. All right. So, I think that's everything. I think the purse is empty. <laughs> Look at this. This is ridiculous. <laughs> okay, the purse is empty. So now we are going to go through all this stuff. See what I actually need and what I don't need. I know this. I need this. This is a necessity. This was like the most important thing in there. <laughs> How's it going, you guys? So right here, I have some pretty much menstrual pills. 
I'm gonna keep these in there. It's nice to have just in case. Um, we have some sweet pea hand sanitizer that my mom gave me that I'm actually not really a big fan of. It's too sweet for me, but I'm gonna keep it in there anyways because I like to have a hand sanitizer on me at all times. This one we are going to hit with the little wipes because obviously it's got little dog hairs on it and it's dirty. <laughs> Alrighty guys, this is the knife that my boyfriend gave me. My boyfriend gives me so many weapons, like no joke. I have a knife, I have a taser, I just have like all this stuff. Don't mess with me, don't mess with me. Okay, I have um, tanning goggles, don't need, don't need piles. Okay, this is my gym. My gym thing, do need this. I like to keep this on me at all times. Cheat pile. Lighter, I like to have a lighter on me at all times, just in case. You never know. I don't smoke, but you never know when you're gonna get stuck in a forest somewhere and you happen to have your purse on you and you're just like, I just remembered I have a lighter in my purse. <laughs> So I have this from my last job. It is a headband where I was like a hippie and it went around my, don't need this, whatever. <laughs> okay. Um, this is something that I like to get the chicken nuggets on the kids menu and it obviously comes with toys. Uh, me and my boyfriend really, oh, we really like these little things because he says it like looks like me because my eyes are really big. <laughs> Um, this is actually the Husky. Doesn't look like a Husky to me. I bought him one of the Huskies because he's got blue eyes and this doesn't look like a Husky to me. <laughs> but I'm gonna put that in the, put somewhere else pile, not my purse. <laughs> okay, let's see what else. All these receipts automatically go in the trash pile. I don't even know what they are anymore, what they're doing what they were received for. Um, you can't even read them anymore, so it's really irrelevant. So all these receipts, trash. Okay. Wallet, I've already cleaned out my wallet, so it is nice and clean for the most part in there. Um, this is just a Jessica Simpson wallet that I got at TJ Maxx a while back ago. It's been a really, really good wallet. Um, so we're just gonna keep this in the keep pile, obviously, and we're just gonna clean it off a little bit. Um, this was given to me by a friend. Um, she got one night, her boyfriend got it for her because she was, they were just drunk and he got it for her at a gas station. She gave it to me um, because my boyfriend was traveling for work and she was like, you need to put this on your keychain. So just everybody knows, I don't know, she's a goober, but I love her for it, but this is not going in the keep pile. It doesn't need to just be in my purse randomly. It'll probably just go in a keepsake box somewhere. Oh, more little trash pieces. Trash pieces, trash pieces. Um, tampons. Sorry if any guys are watching this. Gonna keep these tampons in the purse. Can't really clean these off, but I like to have backups just in case. If you're a girl, you know what I mean. You know, you, you like to have them. You never know what's gonna happen. <laughs> Oh geez, this is just, this is sad. These are headphones I actually use. These are gonna go back in the purse. Um, I never know when I'm going to be hitting up the gym. So I like to keep these on me with my, you know, tag thing to go to the gym. <laughs> these I don't think even work. And there's an earring attached in there, which the other earrings over here, um, these actually, look like they're still in working order. Not the headphones, the earrings. So we are going to, yay, they kind of are. They're cheap earrings to begin with, but I, no, 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 no. This one's missing the other part. Never mind, never mind. <laughs> this is all going in trash. These don't work anymore with my phone because I got the new iPhone and it doesn't have, I don't like how it doesn't have the a little pluggy for it. I don't know if I'm just old school or what. Okay, guys. So far, this has been a 
bad as I thought it was. Um, it's not too bad, you know? Okay, so my keys, I can go ahead and take out my keys. I know that I'm going to need these keys. Um, this is what I was talking about earlier. My boyfriend got me this for like Valentine's Day or something, and it is my pepper spray. So along with my knife, come at me, come at me, bro. Like, I can take you on. <laughs> so keep pile. Oh, and also I wanted to show you all this. I got this at um, Hobby Lobby, and it says you got this. And it's just really nice and motivating, and it's a little dirty, so I'm gonna clean that off as well. Okay, and then we have like chapsticks galore, so we're gonna put those over there. Um, then there's random pills that I don't even know. I think they're allergy pills. I don't even know what kind of pills these are. I have no idea, but they're gonna go in the cute pile because if I had them in my purse, they probably weren't anything too like legit. They were like allergy pills or something. And you never know when your allergies are gonna start kicking your butt, right? <laughs> have pins, change, and chapsticks, and lip glosses. Okay, if you don't see a trend here, I am trying to find the perfect pink chapstick or lipstick or lip gloss. If you know one that fits a kind of tan, fair skin, hazel eye, brown, a nut brown, blonde haired girl, hit me up, let me know if you have found the perfect one. I asked a woman about this one at, at the restaurant. I was like, girl, what are you wearing on your lips? It looks really good. Got it? Doesn't look the same on me. Doesn't look the same. The closest one I've found that I like the most out of all these is going to be from Bath and Body Works, this orchard. It's actually what I have on right now. And it tastes like coconut. It smells like you can smell it. It smells like coconut. And it's a really nice, subtle pink without being too pink or too like nude. You know what I'm saying? I just, I can't ever find like the perfect peak. And so the pins are keepers. I like to have a couple pins in my um, purse, like at all times, just in case. The change is actually going to be go in this change thing that I have. And then all these chapsticks, I am probably out of all these going to keep the orchard. Um, the lip vibrance is pretty nice. Um, it gives you like a little like red, like a, just a little bit of a tint and it has SPF. And then I'm trying to think which one. I, I probably use this one the most. I got this um, at like a natural food store and it's, come on, focus. I don't, I don't know if that's focusing, but it's a liacin one. I mean, it has, it's like all natural ingredients and it's really, really good. It's kind of a weird texture. It smells really good. It's kind of weird, but I like it if I just need something like chapstick wise. And all these are just gonna go somewhere else. Guys, okay, so now we are going to take each individual item and we are going to go ahead with our wipies and we are going to just wipe all those items down. I'm also gonna wipe my purse down because you know, it, it's one of those things that it goes everywhere with me. It goes in the grocery store, et cetera, et cetera. So it probably has a little bit of funk on it. perfect it's not like my purse is like super dirty I'm just trying to go over it and kind of get just like the germs germs off you know and then I'm gonna do the same to my wallet to get those parts that like your hands touch like the most for instance this little thing 
making sure to get that. Now we're putting the wallet back into the purse. Woo! <laughs> First thing down. Now we're gonna just wipe off everything else. going to be doing now is I'm going to be putting everything back in my purse. So remember my wallet is already in there. So the chapsticks I like to keep on the outside just in case I need them. Um, so this is like my inside outside pocket and this is my outside pocket. So I'm just going to put these in there. Yay. And then my pins can just go inside because it's not something I reach for often. It's just something that I might need every now and then. And I do have like a, an inside pocket that you can just zip up. So I'm going to put my pins in there with actually my lighter. And then I'm going to also put these in there, the pills, um, because I probably won't ever reach for those. And if I do, not very often. I'm going to put these inside the inside outside pocket so they're still really easy to access um, but they're not cluttering up the inside of my purse. I like to keep my knife somewhere that I can easily reach it so if I'm carrying around my purse it's going to be closed like this um, with a zipper on <laughs> so I like to keep it on the outside of my purse where my chapstick is so if I need to reach for it when I'm walking I know exactly where it is and then last but not least my hand sanitizer um, and let's see my hand sanitizer and my tampons there is a little pocket inside here that doesn't actually zip up but it keeps everything in there really nice and neat I'm just going to put those in there because they're not going to fall out or anything being in there. Um, but they're just still there if I need to access them. And then lastly, my keys are going to go in there with my wallet. So now all that's in there in the actual big part is my keys and my wallet, my two major necessities. And that's it. It is nice clean everything in there is clean it's only the things that i absolutely need and i am ready to take it with me <laughs> okay you guys so everything is clean and sorted out into my purse and when i have to go to work later i have it ready to go look how nice that looks i don't know it just looks nice right um so like i said it feels really good to do things like this whether it is for your house, your room, your office, your car, your wallet, um, your purse. Just start somewhere small. The next one that I'm actually going to be doing for y'all um, in this kind of subject is going to be cleaning out my makeup bag. 
that's gonna be fun i'm gonna go somewhere take you along with me we're gonna find a new cute like minimalistic makeup bag and then i'm gonna go through all my makeup show you what i actually use and what i don't use we're gonna clean it all off and then put it inside the new makeup bag nice fresh and clean so if you enjoyed this video guys please give it a thumbs up um and then please subscribe to my channel i know i'm very new on here um, but I really want to give y'all things that y'all will find useful and maybe inspire you to do the same thing. Uh, things like this really raise your vibrations and make you feel better about your day. And like I said, even though it is an object, you know, it's just a purse at the end of the day, that purse was given to you by the universe. You were able to have that purse in your power because of what you've manifested. You manifested that purse you know, and the things that are in that purse. So you need to respect that stuff. That way the universe gives you more of those things in abundance. Um, and it just raises your vibrations and shows the universe, like, listen, I know you gave this to me and <clears throat> I appreciate it. The universe is different for everybody. For me, when I say the universe, I mean God. Um, the universe is my God. I think God is everything around us. Um, and he's an all powerful being. Um, so, but that's for a, a different day and a different subject. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember, send out good vibrations, guys, throughout your day. Uh, maybe you will just change somebody's day in the process. And have a wonderful day.